I'm like, you went that way. I went this way. Wow. <laughs> wow. You just say one thing and it's just... <clears throat> whoosh, here we go. That actually looked kind of wrong in a way. It was oh. like I was opening something. And you'll never know, you two. You'll never know what he opened. Or you might. Depends on how he edits this. Honestly, I'm kind of curious on what I opened too. <laughs> is it Pandora's box? Yeah, probably. Getting this so, channel? Yeah, it probably is. So metal. Pandora's box. Which works out pretty good. Yeah. As we're doing metal today. Are we? Yeah. Sure? Yeah. It okay. says metal right there on the video. <laughs> mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. This song is extremely metal. Please be advised. It doesn't say that. But uh, we've been sleeping on this one. Mostly because it just came out. <laughs> yeah. Um, but this is O Sleeper. Okay. <laughs> oh, they're not going to like that at all. Yeah, well, we're not here to make friends. We're here yeah. to make family. No? No. No. No, no I don't no. know. I don't know what that was. I don't know. Mm, so how, this is probably, how, good, this is how, probably a good time just to step over that and say the song is called Pulse Over Throne. Yeah. I'm no like, segue necessary. No, I'm still kind of confused. Maybe we should just go into the song then. We should probably just yeah, get we, this going because yeah, this, this, this is this is this is a train wreck. This mm -hmm. is th yeah, we literally opened Pandora's box right now. This is a this is a, a train wreck uh, full of dumpsters that are on fire. Yes, there we go. Just play the song. Just play. Play. Right off the bat? Right off the bat. Right off the bat. Does what? this give you the uh, front man spitting water vibe? A little bit. <laughs> like they start hitting the drums, he's like... <laughs> oh yeah, like... This guys, like, is it? Simple yeah. stair roll. Yeah. That's yeah. something that I would do. Throws a water bottle at the tech. Yeah, I'd be like, hey! I'm like, ah, oh, what the f Sorry. You can only pray that the tech throws it back at him. <laughs> oh, uh, bless. They're just uh, full of themselves. No? Maybe. Okay, play a song. <laughs> the most downplayed chorus huh i've uh, i've heard in a while i honestly didn't think that was more a chorus than anything i thought that was like just a second part of a verse yeah like it's super downplayed huh the song's been kind of weird so far like everything it's it's not following a norm i'm like oh they'll build it up here there'll be some double kick then they, they had, took like, it down then they had that pause like yeah. weird um oh, well, they, they, they took it down mm -hmm. and the clean vocal kind of threw me off there a little, it was like more of a slam vocal, not a straight clean. But the way the way that opening riff was building up, oh yeah, that yeah. was not the vocal I was expecting. Yeah, you were thinking more of like, okay, we're we're taking it down a bit, yeah, like, clean vocal, mm -hmm. okay, slam vocal. There we go mm -hmm. with some backing screams. It's like this is. See, different. I was kind of going the other way with it because with that opening riff, I thought it was going to be more like some fuck shit up. Which hard vocal? Which no, no sleeper is known for. Yeah, which they're technically doing. Mm -hmm. So this is giving me a mastodon feel. Eh, uh, like it's just stoner like stoner proggy metal. Well, like because I don't get stoner proggy ness from the not song. not the stoner part. Okay, more, okay. more of like the the uh, the laid back heavy. Does that make sense? Like it's real heavy, mm -hmm. but it's still got that like kind of like approachable nature. Yeah, like you know. Uh... <laughs> I, mm, I can see it. I, I can I can see what you're getting at. Like like chilling, having a beer, drinking or uh, drinking Cheetos. No, <clears throat> eating Cheetos. What the fuck? While, while listening to Slayer, like you're chilled out, but you still got Slayer blaring. 
And then when all the normal people walk by, they're like, what? Yeah. Like, so. That is the most relaxed guy listening to death metal I've ever seen in my life. That kind of feel. Yeah. Oh, that's always fun <laughs> when I'm at work. I'm just like listening to like Black Dahlia Murder mm -hmm. and everything. I'm like, how? How? I'm like, what? You never just work casually on your computer while listening to death metal? What the fuck? They don't know how to live. No, they don't. Nah, let's get back into this. Yeah. <laughs> frantic there yeah that was, he more was of like going a, a little off and then they're like when we sing and we're like yeah that was like kind of like you, a weird you sing when no, I, don't say, <laughs> I don't think it was a weird but it was like a a different scream it was i guess it was kind of like more of a throwback to like hardcore scream i it was not like a, straight it, metal. it was more of a tangent ah, a little, like he was just getting irritated like, like go like getting worked up yeah which mm -hmm. no we listen to a lot of bands yeah they over the over the years so yeah but no i i think that just but, had like more of a hardcore vibe uh, yeah, to it. it it just it built up it, it, with that hardcore vibe idea though they missed the 808 yeah they did but and eh. then, then the, the three bars of nothing like, and then we sing yeah because with that pause do, they could just do, easily do, kicked do, in do, a bass do, drop and yeah. like there that would have been a nice little crescendo yeah but no, it's like, like everybody stopped took a drink oh we gotta still play the song or, oh yeah we're, we gotta get to the the outro <laughs> sorry but like it's that, like so the, good. The, the, it's got that. It's uh, it's the same idea as uh, Megadeth's Trust, that weird pause in it. Mm. <laughs> You're like, is this, uh, mm -hmm. was this a uh, accident or did you plan this? Just awkward. I don't know, but I liked a lot of the riffing. Yeah, a lot. Of, it was like a lot. A lot of the riffing was actually mm -hmm. syncopated with the uh, double kick, which I thought yeah. that was a really cool accent. I'm like, yeah, that's. I like that. It's still kind of weird that it's like they, they, it's mellow. Yeah, it's real mellow. Like they're in the middle there. They really brought it mm -hmm. down. It worked. A lot of homework thing, and stuff like that, but they brought it down. One thing I, I kind of question is, like, obviously this band has two vocalists in it. Yeah. But, um, obviously one's the guitarist. But it's, this was just, like, scream on scream. Mm -hmm. It wasn't, like, the normal, like, scream, like, no, scream, and then the clean accent. It's, like... But really, it worked. It worked, but I'm kind of questioning at the I same time, like... I don't like, think, I don't think the, 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 the scream on clean would work for the... the this the track, riff. no. This track, yeah. no. Um, maybe, like, a clean accent hidden in the mix... To like mm -hmm. you know, mesh with the the scream. Yeah, but that's just me. Instead, um, they picked the hey hey hey, like which was really that was weirdly more, placed. That, that was more of a chant. It was like <clears> yeah, but it was weirdly too. placed. Yeah, like chorus, like mid in that like yeah, like they like they had this thing where they're like oh we haven't said anything in so long. Hey hey hey, all right, right yeah, we're good. It was like okay, we um, hit fifteen seconds. <laughs> it seemed seconds. like it was forced. It's like okay, we hit fifteen seconds. Uh, yeah. Let's do like a, a quad hey. Yeah. There we go. Yeah, and it was real. It was real deep in the mix, yeah. which is really weird. It I was, was like, all right, that's an option. Yeah. Not the one I would pick, but yeah, uh, we were like, oh, I'm not the producer. It's like mm -hmm. here, let's throw in the gang vocal. Yeah. So, but overall, no, overall, I, I, I still like. The, yeah, I still small, like it. Small gripes and complaints. Yeah. 
more of nitpicking. Mm. I can definitely hear, see, like, when I think, like, this album is, like, the first time I actually listened to O Sleeper. You've been sleeping on O Sleeper? I've been sleeping on O Sleeper. <laughs> um, but the thing is, is the only reason why I knew, of, I obviously heard the name over the mm. years, but I just never really went down the road of listening to him. And the only reason why I knew of them more so is because of Woven War. Mm -hmm. When they yeah, that yeah. band started after the, the supergroup. Yeah, the supergroup, which was like one record. You want two, two, <laughs> two records. records, two, right, records. Two, records. two records. I actually want that band to come back. I want they won't. I want Everybody, everybody's back working again. Everyone's here's Asley dying and O Sleeper yeah. back. They're like, mm -hmm. fuck Woven War. I'm like, that, come that, on. That, that was an unemployment band. <laughs> Yeah, they're like we need to <laughs> ah, make shit, money. The, the day job is on hiatus. Yeah. Let's let's start another job. <laughs> yeah, but that basically is what. Oh shit, we're going back to the day job. All right, this one's done. Back. Oh yeah, we're back. There we go. It's like sorry, I got put. In. Here's my resignation. We're like God damn it. My old job called me back. I'll, I'll talk to you guys later. I mean, yeah, I've been sleeping. I'm not a sleeper. Would you say you're woke now? Slightly. More of like a more of like a groggy wake up. I'm like, Ugh. this is just this is just a, a dirty old mattress of jokes. But uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, sorry. <clears throat> they have to be done. No, I'm in. Yeah, this is decent. Yes. Weird. It's it like still gets with that Mastodon feel though. I don't know. I just I just hear like old school metalcore. Mm. So Mastodon. <laughs> nah. <laughs> Mastodon's like prog rock. No one has ever said that in the history of saying things. I'm not even a big Mastodon fan. Yeah, neither am I. Um, so, yeah. Um, eh, I'll probably listen to the record. I don't know if this one will hit the list by itself. I think this is like one like one of those one-off deep cuts mm -hmm. that you... But, uh, it, but it, it'll be on the record. When I yeah. listen to the record, it'll be played. It's not going to mm -hmm. hit the, the main list. Obviously, there's a. this is the deep cut. Yeah. In my mind. When I, when I listened to the record, this wasn't the, <clears> one of my... This wasn't a uh, single? It wasn't one of the, my top, Yeah, you no. Know, it wasn't a standout choice, track. Yeah. But clearly it is given the fact they made a lyric video. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But, no. Or, or it's not. I don't, just don't care. Well, like, let's just <laughs> give everything a lyric video. Yeah. Okay. So, all right. Well, I was O Sleeper. Yeah. Pulse Overthrown. Mm-hmm. Off um, of the what album? What's this album Oh, called? God. It's something, like, really nasty. Oh, Bloody Unbowed. Yeah. So, oh, Bowed. Okay. Um, what you I read that as Unbowled. And I was like, no, blood and poop. What, what do you think they are? Cannibal Corpse? No, they're good. No, yeah, they're good. They're good. They're yeah. they're good guys. So uh, lyrically, it's pretty standard. It's pretty like. Metal. There were a couple things in here that popped out to me though that I liked. Um, like the the tonight we on hell we dine. Mm -hmm. I like that. I mm -hmm. like that. Um, there was another line here that really kind of caught me where I was like, that's pretty cool, and I can't. I don't know. For this part where he got like really weird and started going on a tangent, it got, it got a little Dungeons and Dragonsy for me. Yeah, we are the Chaos Keeps. Our, the, our blood is the mortar. Our, yeah. our king is one of pulse overthrown. We are moving. What we are? Yeah, we are the moving wall. The armored march. The archers. The medics. The fireborn <laughs> resistance. Immortal. We'll face them one on one. One on one. One thousand, and we'll sing. Yeah. So yeah, that was good. More like battle anthem. Me. Yeah, I, I felt like I had to roll a twenty side die for it at that point. Yeah, it's like song. okay, so there we go. But I don't. Wasn't this band like always deemed like a Christian? Or yeah, really? but Demon Hunter's Christian too. Yeah, but they, they don't didn't like say, say any like bad. This. They didn't say any bad words. Well, I know bad words. I'm just actually I think this band is more like a, I don't want to say agnostic, but they're like atheists in a way. Yeah, they just they just play on the religious tropes. Yeah, sure. So that's why I get it from yeah. when I listen to this album mm -hmm. at least. So, but yeah, I mean other than that, it's it's pretty uh, pretty standard. Standard metal mm -hmm. cliche. Yeah, lyrics. No, Border, like, borderline cliche, power metal. Yeah. Borderline power metal lyrics. Because of the <clears throat> Dungeons and Dragons. Yeah, Dungeons and Dragons. It's, it's, just be honest, it's yeah, Dungeons yeah. and Dragons. It's, it's like Dragon Force, but like more yeah. heavy. So, yeah. yeah. More Dungeons, less Dragons. So, all right. Yeah. Oh, Sleeper Pulse over thy, over thy throne. I'm adding words. Pulse over throne. <laughs> there we go. So, until next time, YouTube. See you guys then.